This phase involves precision as the foundation is carefully aligned and settled onto the piles, securing a solid base for the entire edifice. Engineers and construction teams oversee this crucial step to ensure the foundation's alignment and integrity, guaranteeing a stable platform for the structure. Simultaneously, the installation of floor plates commenced. These plates form the groundwork for the building's flooring, serving as the base upon which subsequent layers and materials are added. The precise laying of these plates requires accuracy to ensure a level surface essential for the building's structural integrity and the subsequent construction stages. Moreover, the installation of the drainage system took place during this initial phase. Proper drainage is imperative to prevent water accumulation around or beneath the structure, safeguarding against potential water damage and ensuring the longevity of the building. The drainage system's installation involves laying pipes and connections strategically to efficiently manage water flow away from the building, maintaining its stability and durability over time. On the first day of construction, the focus revolved around foundational elements critical to the building's stability and functionality. The process commenced with the placement of the foundation atop prepared piles, a fundamental step ensuring the structure's support and load-bearing capacity. On the second day of construction, the focus was on finalizing essential groundwork. The drainage system, crucial for managing water flow, was connected with precision. This involved linking pipes and ensuring proper connections to safeguard the building against potential water-related issues. Simultaneously, workers filled the surrounding area with soil, meticulously leveling and compacting it around the house providing stability and completing the groundwork for further construction phases. On day three, the construction focused on the meticulous application of the base layer, known as the Kimlog, a critical element in ensuring a strong bond between the foundation and the subsequent layers. This layer acts as a crucial adhesive, enhancing the stability and cohesion of the structure. Additionally, the assembly of the construction moved forward as workers commenced the intricate process of applying adhesive to affix the aerated concrete blocks. Each block's placement demands precision and care to create a solid, durable structure initiating the formation of the building's walls and defining its structural integrity. Day 4 marked significant progress in the construction as attention shifted to the completion of load-bearing walls. The meticulous process of gluing aerated concrete blocks continued, focusing on the remaining sections crucial for structural support. Workers ensured precise application of adhesive, meticulously placing each block to create sturdy load-bearing walls. Simultaneously, the erection of scaffolding took place, Scaffolds are vital in facilitating safe access for workers to higher sections of the building, enabling them to work efficiently on the structure's elevation. Skilled workers assembled the scaffolding system, ensuring it met safety standards and provided secure platforms for subsequent construction phases. The completion of the load-bearing walls and the installment of scaffolding are pivotal stages, defining the building's structural framework and facilitating access for upcoming construction tasks. These crucial steps laid the groundwork for further vertical development and subsequent stages of the building's assembly. Day 5 marked an impressive leap forward in construction, 
achieving a multitude of pivotal tasks in a remarkably efficient manner. The installation of the upper-level flooring commenced, a crucial step in establishing the building's next level. Skilled workers meticulously laid out the flooring, ensuring a level and sturdy foundation for the upper story. Simultaneously, workers hung gutters along the building's edges, essential for proper water drainage and management. The precise placement of window frames was executed, outlining spaces for future windows, enabling further progress in sealing the structure. Additionally, the installation of gables, crucial for the roof's support and aesthetic appeal, took place. These elements added architectural character and structural integrity to the building's design. Finally, the walls of the upper floor were positioned, defining the spatial layout and bringing the building closer to its final form. Accomplishing these diverse tasks in a single day showcased remarkable coordination and efficiency, significantly advancing the construction progress and shaping the building's structure and functionality. Day 6 witnessed remarkable advancements in the construction process, particularly in the building's upper structure. The installation of roof panels marked a pivotal stage, providing shelter and protection for the entire edifice. These panels, carefully positioned and secured, formed the structural basis for the building's protective covering. Simultaneously, the assembly of roof windows and dormers took place, introducing natural light and ventilation into the upper spaces while adding architectural character to the structure. The positioning of chimneys furthered the building's functionality, facilitating proper ventilation and heating systems. Moreover, the technical aspects saw significant progress as the plumber and electrician commenced their installations. Their early involvement is crucial, initiating the integration of essential systems within the building's framework. Their work involving laying pipelines, wiring, and setting up electrical connections lays the foundation for the building's functionality and comfort. The day's accomplishments showcased not only the physical structure's progression, but also the integration of essential technical components essential for the building's functionality and comfort. On day seven, the roofing phase commenced with the placement of black tiles atop the house. Despite the scorching weather, the roof tiles were laid, securing the building's topmost protective layer. This process not only shields the structure from external elements, but also contributes to its aesthetic appeal. Simultaneously, interior work progressed as walls and ceilings were covered with plasterboard mounted on battens. This preparation readies the surfaces for future plastering, laying the groundwork for the interior finishing touches, enhancing both durability and aesthetics within the building. On day eight, the focus was on fortifying the building's energy efficiency and environmental control. The insulation process involved fitting materials within walls, floors, and ceilings to regulate temperature and conserve energy. Concurrently, measures were taken to ensure the home was airtight, sealing any potential gaps or openings that could compromise temperature control. This meticulous process not only enhances comfort within the space by maintaining desired temperatures, but also contributes significantly to energy efficiency, reducing heat loss or gain and promoting a more sustainable living environment.
De Nine marked a significant step as the construction progressed with the masonry of the front and side walls, orchestrated by an exceptional team of skilled artisans. These craftsmen showcased remarkable expertise, their precision evident in each brick meticulously placed to form the building's exterior. Their exceptional craftsmanship extended beyond technical proficiency. They brought a palpable sense of warmth and professionalism to the construction site, creating a reassuring and pleasant environment. Their friendliness and dedication to their craft elevated the construction experience, fostering a sense of trust and appreciation among the homeowners. Witnessing their mastery in action was more than witnessing mere construction. It was observing a blend of expertise and passion shaping the very foundation of a home. Their commitment to excellence ensured not just the physical structure's integrity, but also instilled confidence that the house was being built with care and skill. Their presence and workmanship infused a sense of pride and gratitude, knowing that these skilled craftsmen were contributing their artistry to create a space that would soon become a cherished home. Standing as a beacon of innovation, this colossal printer harnesses advanced additive manufacturing techniques specifically tailored for the construction industry. Its mammoth size allows for the seamless creation of large-scale structures, such as the 90-square-meter house, while ensuring architectural intricacies and structural integrity. With a combination of specialized concrete mixtures and intricate layering processes, this printer meticulously fabricates each segment of the building. Layer by layer, the printer deposits and solidifies the concrete. Following the design blueprint with exacting accuracy, this technique not only expedites construction, but also minimizes material waste, promoting sustainable building practices. The printer's advanced functionalities enable the incorporation of diverse architectural elements and features, accommodating the complexities of a multi-story dwelling. From walls to intricate structural components, this innovative printer adeptly brings to life the envisioned design, setting new benchmarks for construction efficiency and design flexibility. Building a house commences with the critical step of pouring the foundation, an essential base that ensures structural integrity. Using a concrete sprayer, workers distribute and level the concrete mix across the designated area. This sprayer allows for precise application, ensuring an even surface and proper alignment. As the foundation takes shape, it's crucial to monitor its levelness and smoothness, to guarantee stability and support for the entire structure. The concrete spraying process professionals who work systematically, carefully navigating the sprayer to uniformly coat the ground. This method not only streamlines the pouring process, but also minimizes errors, enhancing the foundation's durability and strength. Upon completion of the foundational concrete work, the next phase involves installing the floor for the subsequent level. Typically, this process involves careful planning and execution to ensure structural integrity and optimal functionality. Builders begin by examining the foundation to confirm its readiness for the floor installation. Any imperfections or irregularities are addressed, guaranteeing a smooth surface for the new floor. For concrete floors, a reinforcement framework is laid out to support the load-bearing capacity of the structure. Steel bars, known as rebar, are strategically placed within the foundation to enhance strength and durability. Once the framework is in place, concrete is poured and meticulously leveled to create a solid and even base. The installation process also considers various elements like plumbing, electrical conduits, and insulation, which may be incorporated within or beneath the floor, depending on the design and functional requirements of the building. Quality assurance checks are conducted throughout this phase to confirm the integrity of the installed floor. Any necessary adjustments or refinements are made to ensure that the foundation for the next level is robust, stable, and ready to support the ongoing construction process.